Okay, I'm gonna assume that everything is live ready. So, hello, this is Chuck. Uh, <laughs> we're finally back again with Deus Ex Human Revolution. Sorry. Oh my god, YouTube. What? Yes, thank you. Um, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> just... Okay, so I, I guess there's some sort of weird update with the whole YouTube live control. I am live, right? What in the world? Huh, okay. Sorry, I'm trying to... Hmm. Now it says I have two viewer counts going. I can't see. For some reason, the YouTube studio... If you could just work with me here. I know it's been some time since I've recorded, but like, work with me, YouTube. <laughs> I beg of you, please. So I am super early this time, and this is me trying to beat the heat. Oh my god, why is it like this? What in the hell? Oh my god. This is... Oh, this is so weird. I don't understand what's going on. Uh, the system changed, apparently. Or maybe I'm just clicking on the wrong thing, though that's weird. Okay, well, <laughs> I don't know what was going on. Uh, I couldn't... <clears throat> the live studio format... Well, it wasn't letting me see the stream, so I'm just gonna have to do it old-fashioned way, I guess, or just go to the stream itself. Uh, so yes, I am really early. Um, aside from, like, my hands giving me issues, my arms and my hands just feeling really tired from the day's work and other things. I am early because I'm trying to beat the heat because I frankly do not do well and today is supposed to get to, what, 30 <laughs> degrees? Tomorrow is supposed to be 34 degrees. This is Celsius, by the way. So if you're in the US, I don't know how to change out the Fahrenheit. <laughs> but um, yeah, so we're going to get started. It's already feeling really hot. It is... It's 6. It's 6.30 in the morning here. <laughs> and I'm already... I can feel it. <laughs> the day is starting. But yes, good morning, Paul Springer, regulator. Okay. Now to remember what... <laughs> what I was doing here. This has been such a long time. So, I broke into that apartment building. Now, okay, we need to get inside the Hive nightclub. So I know there's like, there's multiple ways. There's like a back door. We can go into the front. I just identified the hacker who was controlling that suicide terrorist. Ari Van Bruggen, aka Windmill. Trouble is, he's running from the mercs. Malik thinks the owner of the hive 
a popular nightclub in the Quaigon district of Lower Hengshai, can tell me where he's hiding. Okay, so that's why. It doesn't happen often, folks, but it appears that I may have to retract an earlier statement. Millionaire Hugh Darrow has contacted me personally to deny allegations of involvement in secret United Nations meetings about the augmentation debate. Here's what the man had to say. My visit to Prague was related exclusively to the project which has consumed all of my attention these days. You're referring to the Panchea Project, the cooperative global initiative that aims at healing our world. Earthseeker's fear is in serious trouble, Eliza. And it's time that we as a species stepped up to make things better. Our best chance at doing this is to modify ocean temperatures through a combination of iron seeding and geothermal management. Forgive me, Mr. Darrow. But many people believe that your Arctic Ocean installation is more risk than certainty. When will we be able to see the truth for ourselves? As soon as the installation is complete. If you would like to hear more of my exclusive interview with Hugh Darrow, log on to www.pikesweb.com. This is Eliza Kassan reporting to you live from Pikes. Okay. Sorry, just watching some news. Very important news, I guess. Oh, that's just moving. I won't let me church. Pick the trash can. All right. So, okay, we just came from the limb clinic. Here we go. Towards Hive. It's been so long. Haha. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love how it takes me through this way. What? You telling me I can't move this? Bull. Can I move something? Can I can I take any of this? Excuse me. This is Okay. I feel lied to. I also need to carry I can't carry. Why can't I carry any of these? If I just stack them. I mean, hmm. I'm assuming this this looks like this makes it look like it's a one-way trip because on this side you have these uh, trash cans that are specifically placed here, so I can jump over, but not so much for that side. Okay, fine, we'll go a different way. For a minute, I thought <laughs> I, there's no beeping, but those look like mines, and I'm like, whoa, what's going on? What am I walking into here? Alright, so I need to find a different route. Man, I got lost just trying to get to this area. Limb clinic. Well, maybe not lost, but... Okay. So over here was a staircase which leads up to nothing. Here we go. Okay, yeah, so we're here. Okay, what's really... Okay, this is as far as I can scroll out. Alright. So, hmm. There's a train station. I'm trying to see stairs. Staircase to what? Very unhelpful. There's a metro station. <laughs> My god, I'm just trying to direct myself to this area. So I guess I can go through, from what I can see, I can go through the Yaojiao dis district. Yaojiao district. And... Is this a horror game? No, this is not a horror game. Uh, goddamn. <laughs> okay. So I guess... Yeah, if I head to the metro station, it'll take me to the Yojiao district, and then I can get to the hive via that way. From what I'm seeing here. I mean... 
Yeah, okay, so the metro is the entry to this district. Nope. What? It. I want to use the train. Did I use the train before? <laughs> I should've been. I'm way too excited for that. <laughs> There's no animation or anything. Huh. Tim announces new cash stimulus for Pangu. Taiyong Medical announced today that it will be making another large investment in the construction of. Hengsha Island, two-tier city on the Yangtze River. Built on split levels, the lower city has already become a bustling hub of exotic nightlife and cultural activity, and the upper city will soon be a center for universities and high-tech research. The single biggest corporate underwriter in China, Taiyong Medical, is injecting an undisclosed sum into Hengsha's economy to ensure new facilities are built to world-class standards. Taiyong's president and CEO, Zhao Runru, spoke about the stimulus package. We want to make Hengsha the undisputed world leader in cybernetics, and we will spare no expense to ensure that we stay on track until our goals are realized. Dara Industries has joined the ranks of employers offering free augmentations as incentive to join the workforce. With the mammoth tank Chia High Arctic installation nearing completion, and another huge facility underway in, in the Indian Ocean. The need for manpower has reached a critical level. Okay. All right. So from here, I should be able to get back to the hive. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay. There's like two ways. It's blocked there and it's blocked there. Hi. Oh, can I not? Can I not enter your store? You're not a no, I'm definitely not around here. Those bell tower idiots are tearing the whole building apart. Especially the penthouse. Okay. So, map again. I'm facing the right direction. What is behind the metro station of curiosity? Is there anything behind here? There's like, I see this space, some like objects maybe. What? There's a, another entry in? Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait. I need to see. I need to see where this goes. <laughs> is this just another entry into... Okay. Okay, so that's just another, that's a way to get in. I came in through the rooftop. Oh! One security rating, okay, not bad. Right, where am I? Okay, hold on. So yeah, I have to go up through this way. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, don't disconnect. Sorry. 80% detection. 60%. Mm -hmm. Access granted. Ooh, okay. It's making me nervous. Anything in here? Besides Pep. Oh wait, cash. There, that was in your shoe. I don't think it counts if you don't actually hide it. What is this? Wait, oh, this is the... This is the pep thing. 
Ha. Okay. Well. It says I don't really care for machine pistol too much. Let's drop this. Is that enough room? It is. Okay, let's look at this. Uh, examine. A pulsed energy projection system, aka PEPS. Knock down multiple opponents at once may result in target falling unconscious. So this is a, okay. So this is a non-lethal weapon. I don't know. Hmm. An experimental weapon designed recently introduced to the marketplace. The pulsed energy projection system is a single shot, non-lethal firearm capable of generating an immense powerful con conical blast wave of concussive force that will knock down enemies, combatants, and displaced small or medium weight objects in its firing range. It is most often used in military scenarios where threat forces must be disarmed and casu casualties kept to minimum. Bear in mind though that the weapon has a long firing cycle, a short operational range, and a lengthy reload time. Okay. Interesting. I like how, like, lengthy reload time is apparently a reload speed of four. <laughs> Long firing cycle. So basically, very... I don't know. I mean, I don't know if it... A short operational range. Okay. Because I once wanted to call it the non-lethal shotgun. I don't know if that would be accurate. Oh, don't drop anything. Do we even have... Yeah, I do. I have some... Okay. So I want to test it out. We can test it out. Sorry, I need that. Okay. Oh, and then my pep is all the way... Okay, never mind. I do have to head back. Oh, no. I keep doing that. Need to let's put this. <laughs> we don't need we don't need the whiskey at the moment. How much? Wait. Okay, good. Whiskey. I was like, how much whiskey? How, how much whiskey do I have? Quite a bit, actually. Uh, wait. Holster holster the weapon. There we go. Can I enter your store? Have I ah. A visitor to Lower City. What do you think of our route, stranger? Doesn't that create a lovely atmosphere? Hmm, yes. Perfect for breaking and entering. All that jazz. Yeah, I've been there. Okay. The hive is this way? Way? Okay. <laughs> Doors open, so I've been in there. Doors open, so I've been in there as well. <laughs> There's this, but then that guy's patrolling. And this guy's here as well. What is? Do you just walk in down the entire... Or can I go there now? Sorry. He waits there. So I don't know if I want to go for it now while he's there. Okay, yeah. Because I'm assuming he has a patrol route. You're going to come back the way you came. Okay, so I say he turns around. I can go in for that uh, hack. Sorry, I was in your way. I'm my bad. Do just ignore me. Hi, hi. What? I'm not doing anything wrong. Don't stay here, La Wai. This city is very dangerous, especially lower. Too many groups fighting for control. Thank you. Why are you just staring at me? <laughs> was I also in your way? Right. <laughs> 
新的零件不错。Okay, so he was definitely talking about us. Hey, hey American, go Yankees! You want good time? Go to the hive. You want better time? Find a home for beautifulest women in Hangzhou. Oh, my God. Yeah, nope, 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 disconnect. That's not happening. <laughs> not without a few stops. Also, I'm super rusty. And he's already there, yeesh. Alright, anyway, let's get to the hive. I'm assuming the hive is this way. Yeah. All right, so we finally, I'm assuming, yes. Wait. Yes, okay, so if I go, okay, these just go around to the same area. So I'm assuming I just have to go straight. Hey, have I uh, checked your back store? No, I didn't. Thank you for the credits. Oh, you have a safe. Hey, I'm gonna save right now. He'll move, right? God, so rusty with this. Hey, yep, just go for it. <laughs> I don't have time to get the, the other thing. Okay, I was like, what's there? Anyway, we're going to go goodbye. <laughs> Ah, the Honghua Hotel. Here we got the hive. Okay, so that's the front entrance. Assuming that's another way to get in. Yeah, okay. So what is at the sewer entrance here? That we just go through the front door. Which should be possible. I'm assuming I just have to, have to smooth talk my way in maybe? Maybe. Okay. Yeah, and I don't have the... Hmm. I don't have the... That upgrade to the spell. I have three praxis points. What? When did I get that? I don't remember. It's been some time. Okay. For one, I mean, I could put this into hacking as well. Because I could easily just go through the front door, I think. Okay, you know what? Let's see... Okay, yeah. let's see about the front door method. I 
And then, because I, I would like to put some of these uh, praxis points into hacking, to some of the hacking stuff to make it easier on myself. Oh, wrong way. Okay, what does this guy got to say? Hello. The Hive is a member's only club, Lao Wai. Without a membership card, I can't let you in. You telling me I gotta pay to get into this dive? We've got a reputation to keep. Can't let just anyone get in here. Just anyone with the money. No pay, no play. You want in or not? Do I even? I don't even think I have a thousand credits. Maybe another time. All right, your business. You come back and see me if you change your mind. Okay, my question is, is there another way to get in here, into this place? Is there a rooftop access? It's actually not much. <laughs> I just realized, it's like the opportunities. Has there, have I seen an opportunity to climb up? I don't think there is. Not that I recall. And what's this say? The courtyard. Okay. Okay, so how much money do I even have? I have 2,000 credits. Or I could just break in via the underground. Because which one, where is it? Skin augmentation. There's augmentation for but for poison, right? This is armor, so basically increase my increase my defense. Cloaking system. Um Icarus landing. Ugh. All the useful things. Arm, torso. Oh, here are lungs. Chemical resistance. Oh, wait. Did I already have it? Wait, wait, no, 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 no. When did I get this? I don't recall getting this. I am very confused right now. Okay, whatever. We're gonna get the parachute thing so I can jump off from high places. <laughs> okay, can I do anything with hacking? Yeah, okay. There we go. Alright, so apparently I already got the resistance thing, though, I mean, it has been on some time, but apparently I already got it in the prior sets. Don't recall doing that, but I must have input... So I'm trusting you, game, that I'm not tricking myself. I'm trusting you to make sure I didn't trick myself. <laughs> Cause that's how it works. Alright. Let's get through. I feel like uh, I've wasted quite some time. Alright. Stay first. Oh, look at that. And then does that dissipate? Yeah, look at that. It's all safe now. Don't have to worry about it anymore. Can't pick up any of this stuff. Okay, just making sure that there's no, there's no any hidden items. Okay. All right, we're in.
<laughs> saw that camera a bit too late. Okay, this is okay. This is a sewer. <laughs> Up there, you say? What's over here? Here's the stairs. Over here, there's a door. That camera's there for a really long time. Ooh. I don't know if there's actually that much time. Okay, sorry. I just don't know which way to go. Seeing if I can time this without getting caught by the... Because if I do this, I'm not going to be able to see. Okay, we made it up. Oh my god, I'm trying to get around this. We're just gonna... Shh. <laughs> I couldn't see a window, but I guess there was a window. I'm assuming, is it gonna still be... Nope, all suspicion's gone. Nope. Music's still there. But they saw me pretty much instantly, or it's one guy saw me. It looks... no, okay. I was about to say it looks like they have all their backs turned, but one guy is actually facing this way. Hmm. Do you ever turn... No, your face is pretty much there the entire time. Yeah, it doesn't really look like it turns away. Okay. Keep that door closed for now. trying to think of like what's the best way and that's okay okay I need your attention 
God, I've totally forgotten how to... Too far? Okay, just so I don't have to deal with it anymore. Assuming this is not temporary. No, it is temporary. Okay. So yeah, I would need to access that area. Okay. Good to know. Maybe I can take those guys out after... Oh wait, there's a guy down there? <laughs> it's like there's too much I want to explore. And it's not even a big area. Is it coming back this way? That's going the other way. Yep, okay. Where does this take me? Oh, not a good sign. Nuke virus. Oh, this is into the... Oh, this is a dead body. Okay. What does your pocket secretary thing say? Uh, please listen, I'm begging you, Dong Mei, don't do this. Why? Were you right? Were you, was this dictating while you were saying this? I'm, I'm just gonna assume that's the case. Otherwise, it just does not make sense. <laughs> don't do this. I know you think you can sweet talk your way out of anything, and most of the time you can, but these guys aren't just anyone. I'm the one who got us into this mess. I'll find a way to get us out, please. Oh, no, okay, this is written. I guess he... Okay, so he tried to talk to these guys at the hive. And, um, yeah, that didn't work out. Okay. I don't need to crouch anymore. Oh, wait, there is a... Hello? Great. Yeah. Is that it? That's it? That's everything in here, huh? Okay. I don't have to hack that door. Man, <laughs> this place is very big. Oh, hello. I need to check the security rating. Wait, what's the security rating? Security rating of five. I don't think I can be, I don't think I'll be even be able to hack it. Okay. Okay, so this is the way we want to get in, but is that as far as he goes? I'm gonna assume so. He hasn't Okay, yeah, that's like... Oh, 
Okay, sorry. I got really nervous when he turned around like that. So I'm gonna wait till he comes back. And uh, knock him unconscious. I could just use a pep gun. That's also an option. Sorry, I literally could not remember. Nothing? Couldn't remember which key was which. Okay, we got that. I mean, okay, sorry, I'm gonna drag you here. It's at least somewhat hidden. Okay. Okay, that's good. I probably don't need to do this, but. I thought you had better manners. Don't you know to knock before entering a room? This isn't a social call, Tom. Ah, uh, you bell tower boys. Always with the funny. So, what you want today? I'm looking for a cyber security specialist named Van Bruggen. You know him? Doesn't ring any bell. What'd he do? Steal something? Let's just say he's pissed off the Dragon Queen. And so will you if she finds out you're riding him. Khan! You know I'd never bet on a loser. Waste of bone and meat? You there? Yeah, boss? Get a message to Van Bruggen. Capsule 301, Alice Guard in part. Tell him. If he stick his head out, Tai Young Medical is gonna chop it off. Malik, you were right. Tong is helping Van Bruggen. He stashed him in the Alice Garden pods. Thought as much. A hacker who knows his way around corporate firewalls would make a valuable asset for the triads. I'm at the pods myself, Jensen. Want me to run interference? No. Don't put yourself at risk. I'm heading there now. Okay. I wasn't expecting that to give me the objective. Okay. So... Curiosity, where would this take in me? The four objective was here. Was it here? Or was I just seeing it wrong? Okay, I must have definitely been seeing it wrong. By oh, never mind. I won't take this alcohol. <laughs> How much? Oh right, I have this. I totally forgot. Rate of fire. What can what can I use? Or you know, I could just combine C and there. Okay, so I can use it with the pistol, or I can use it with the revolver. Um. How much? So you get we get quite a bit of pistol ammo. How much is my revolver ammo? If I can find it. Pistol, pistol. Oh, I do not have any revolver ammo? Well then. Either way, let's examine. So the ray of fire for this is there, I think. It looks like the maximum capacity, if I'm assuming I'm reading this correctly, is just one more. The rate of fire for the... where is it? My pistol. Okay. 
I mean, the likelihood that I'm probably using the pistol more, it would probably be a safer bet if I use this for the pistol. Rather than on the weapon, which the, it, the, it's really going to depend on whether or not I get ammo for it or not. Also, this has a silencer, so you know what? Yeah, let's combine. Come on. <laughs> Here we go. So now our rate of fire should be one more. And then the other thing we can, the last thing we can put on this is a targeting system. This one cannot have a silencer. I'm assuming that's what the X out was. Okay. So, 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 so. I think... Oh, you know what? I guess this- was this his office then? <laughs> I don't know if the layout's correct, but would that be his office? Sorry, I really want- you're still here, right? <laughs> yeah, it goes up. Okay, okay, so this- that is his office. That we- that I almost wanted to try to break into. <laughs> Alright. Well, now that's done and over with, we should... I should test out the weapon that I got. You know what? Let's go up here just so we have a shorter distance to run. Or I could, mm, it's hard to say, because I could just hack it. I could hack it for points, right? Once I take those guys out, then I don't have to worry. Yeah, sorry, I just didn't know how far that extended or not. Actually, if you guys come to me, that would be great. Five. Really? I can't? Oh, here we go. Okay, it's already alarmed though, so... Okay. No one came out. Okay, so that's actually into the club. Damn. So far they've not extended farther out, so now I'm just kind of testing it. So there's no possible way for me to actually close that door now. Nothing, I suppose. Is that or like I throw an object or something? Let's 
So I got caught last time, even though I was crouched, right? I still got caught. Okay. You want? Know Let's just see. Okay, yes, let's read this. Optical enhancement functionality. Dare Industries Development Study 2007. Our core vision enhancement enrichment. Enrichment enhancement implant the human eye with series of suspended organic plastic lenses using embedded security circuitry, sorry, circuitry tied into a nanoscale neural spike that is attached to the optical nerve. Beyond the simple optical functionality of the basic module with provision of an implanted miniature lens array for visual acuity at extended range, there are line enhancements that can become accessible to the implantee if training and or experimental operation. Specifically, the development of automatic environmental parsing, this can include the most basic level of interface with the so-called heads-up display. In the more advanced modes, a literal predictive understanding of electronic system and related environmental cues. In addition, the basic enhancements, enhanced man is automatically protected from a variety of hazardous visual impairment vectors, damage from flesh, flesh, from flash effects, retina burn, and other similar occurrences. I realize now, though, that the pr probably the reason why I think I was stood up the time before, right? Okay, this is awkward because it makes it look like I'm standing up. What the? What is this? I have to go from here, here, here. Oh, this is crazy long. <laughs> what is this? Okay, hold on. Let me just backtrace. Okay, so the path of least resistance is... Okay. Oh my god. Okay, I'm good. Access granted. Okay. This makes me super nervous just being here. <laughs> What? Too late to run. See, this is what I mean. It looks like I'm standing. Come on. My way. No, you come to me. Anytime, guys. What? Seriously? You guys know I'm in here, right? What the? Oh, that is so dumb. <laughs> that is so dumb. Okay. Did they just not feel like coming out? What? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna get the save. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna see what happens if I just stand at the computer and hack it, because they didn't come in. Which is the really weird thing. Is there a guy out there right now? Kinda looks like it, but... No, no one's there. Okay, I'm just going to hack this com let's hack this then. I don't understand. Again. Okay. I don't know if this is the game just glitching right now? Ooh. Oh, damn. There, there you are. Okay, maybe not useful in mu multiple people, but... Oh, interesting. So it's just... It doesn't actually knock them out. Oh. Okay, there's a guy over there as well. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> okay, sorry. Just need to get my aim right. Oh, what? Do you not see all these? What is it, oh my god. My god. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Uh, I'm good. Okay. I'm just, I just want to wait to see if it's going to go unalarmed. Hey. Hey. What happened? Are you, are you walking? I can't tell. It sounds like you're walking. Man, I feel like I've not so much broken the game, but... It's like they instantly for- Come on guys, just walk out a bit more. There's no way I'm blocking the way. Someone there? <laughs> it's gonna keep- This is gonna keep happening. So dumb. Okay. Um, well. I just need to. <laughs> this is. What is. I. Thank you, that you should stay alert. Now, if you actually complete your job 100% and just, you know, come inside, that would be great. Some of you have to stay out there, some of you... This is weird. At least I can drag you from over there. Oh, all you guys look the same, huh? Okay, anything on you? I don't imagine so. All this effort for nothing. Besides a lot of pistol ammo. I mean, I would like to hack into the... Okay, they've calmed down. Interesting, and he went off. Okay, so...
I save, right? Okay, I'm gonna save. And I'm just gonna hack into this, not caring the fact that they see me. Because apparently they don't care to come inside. Access granted. Yeah, they're not doing anything. The guys just stay out there. I can break. <laughs> okay, whatever. Me and Greed set it up, but let him know to come alone. You remember what happened last time. Boss Chun says he's sitting on a huge stash of gear. All of it's top notch condition, should arrange a meeting. Okay, are you actually going to come in this time, boys? No, they are... They're just kind of hovering over there. Wait, hold on. I hacked in. So I'm gonna save now. And then we're just going to read. <laughs> we're just gonna read this. Hi, don't mind me. Just reading your emails. Thank you. Uh, fight night. Bow, Tongan opponent yet... Tongan opponent yet for Khan? Because if not, then I got a prospect you might want to check out. Freaking giant of a Mongolian. 173, 173 centimeters tall, with a left hook like a kicking mule. Could give the soldier a run for his money, and make the club a heck of a lot more. Ping me back if you're interested. Uh, no go, BB. About that little collection job you sent my way. I tried, man. I really did. But the bitch just won't honor the agreement. You know I'm not the one to take no for an answer, especially from the ladies. But this bitch is something else. I'm thinking she actually used the AUG on me to convince me to leave her alone. You want what she you want what she owes, you need another collector. Okay. Anyway. Gonna, we're gonna hack away, everybody. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay. Now, here's the terminal here. Okay, yeah, so there's no way to, for me to hack this. Ooh. Oh, can come. Oh, sucks for me because I see right now it can come from both ends. I'm gonna make it. I won't be able to get go for this though. Access granted. Thank you for the money! Now you guys actually out here? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. So... I don't know how to get into the club itself to visit, <laughs> but clearly I cannot. Camera's down though. See, so yeah, I'm just hacking this for points at this point. Um, hmm. Ooh. Technically, yes. Yeah. So I would potentially want to hack both ends. Oh, yeah, this is not going. Ooh, this is really not going. Okay, you know what? I think I've, uh, let's continue on with the mission. 
I'm sure I'm missing a bunch of stuff not getting inside there, but <laughs> frankly, I don't want to fight through the entire club <laughs> of people. I'm assuming either way the end result, either we go through the front door and have to go through the back end, the, the back, go through that back area. We know where Van Buren is. Alice Pods. This way. So, hmm. I really wish that, you, like, I wasn't standing up while hacking the terminals. I guess it makes stealth a bit, I don't know, more difficult. I'm just gonna cover this. Even though the likelihood of me walking this way again, I'm like afraid I'm just gonna exactly <laughs> drop down by accident. All right, there's no other, there's no optional objectives. So you only need to head to the Alice pods, which actually this way. I was about to go the wrong way. That, is that in a different district? I want to say this. Alice pods this way. Should check for their saves. <laughs> Back here again. Uh, where's the, sorry, directory? Please tell me where to go. Ah, or you know the big sign can tell me. What is my time right now? Okay. Okay. My god, too much talking. Everyone's talking. Anything else here? You don't even have a back room for me to take from? Alright. Yes, yes. Beds on second and third floor. Showers and laundry in basement. You want a park? And no air conditioning. Broken. We got air vent to ventilate the place though. Not so bad. So, how long you want? One month? Two months? Do I even have to talk to this guy? I just assumed I did. Sorry, I thought I could search through. Did we just like... I guess when we pick it up, we unplug it <laughs> by accident. Not so much by accident. Oh, hello. Is no one in here? Okay. Probably check beforehand whether people are going to come by, but too late. All uh, right. It's about to say. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was close. Okay, I'm gonna have to wait for that, I think. I'm assuming I can go back for it. It's gonna be a lot harder to get in, though. I mean, hmm, I'm so tempted to.
I think I just wasted that. Yeah. Access denied. <laughs> Jensen, I... I was on my way out. What are you doing here, Malik? I told you I got this one. I know. I, I didn't do anything. Trust me. Van Bruggen's all yours. Hang on a second. Something's wrong. What is it? Why are you here? It's nothing. I mean, can't a girl have secrets? Okay. Of course, but I can tell something's bothering you. And I'm concerned. What's going on? I just... I just had to look into something. For a friend. She... She deserved better. I'm listening. Fine, since you're so damn curious. Years ago, I used to live here, remember? My friend, my best friend, Evelyn. She was like a sister to me. Made living here fun. But then, there was an accident. She... She's dead. I'm sorry, Malik. Wait, Jensen, let me finish. I thought I was okay with it, but I know. I know she didn't just die. She was killed, murdered. Her damn scumbag boyfriend did it. I know he did. I knew he was trouble right from the start, but she just wouldn't listen to me. Malik, easy. If your friend was murdered, the police would have suspected something. They would have investigated. That's just it. There was no investigation. They said she fell down a flight of stairs like it was some kind of freak accident. But her wounds, the way she died, they don't add up. It's right here in the damn blood spatter analysis. Blood spatter? You've seen the police report? Yes. A friend left a copy of it in a pod here for me to pick up. Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but I think... I think there's been a cover-up. I just have to prove it. If I could get my hands on the autopsy report, the one that never surfaced, I know I'd get the truth. Except... Why do I suspect I'm about to get dragged into something? Look, Jensen, I'm sorry. I know Van Bruggen is the priority here. And I told you it was my business and I could take care of it. It's just... The more I think about it, the more I realize I'm in over my head. I'm just a pilot. I'm not a damn cop. But I need to know the truth. Okay. This autopsy report. Once you got your hands on it, what were you planning on doing next? I... I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm a pilot, not a cop. But I just... I felt I had to do something while I had the chance. Maybe once you get the report and we know what it says, we can... improvise. <laughs> okay. Um... You said you've seen the police report. Who gave it to you? An old friend who was also a good friend of Evelyn's. He used to work for the Shanghai PD. He left a copy of it, along with a few other things concerning Evelyn, in a pod here for me to look at. He also left some instructions on how to contact someone at Lim for the autopsy report he's convinced was intentionally buried. Why would Lim have anything to do with Evelyn's autopsy report? Well, if you haven't noticed, the Chinese government has been outsourcing branches of its public services for years. Bell Tower polices the streets, and nowadays Lim does more than just cosmetic surgery. They're often contracted for special cases like Evelyn's. And what made Evelyn's case so special, you think? Her boyfriend, Lee. He was at the scene. He had Evelyn's blood on him and tested positive for alcohol and drugs in his system. With his rap sheet, it wasn't looking good for him. But his family, they're on a lot of boards with deep pockets and a lot of reach. They wouldn't suffer the embarrassment of having their son indicted on a suspected murder charge. Okay. Why do you suspect Evelyn's boyfriend had something to do with her death? Because he was poison, right from the start. Born into money and influence, but never once assuming responsibility for anything. I don't think he's worked an honest day in his life. So he was a wealthy, big-headed asshole. If that was reason enough to accuse someone of murder, half the world would be in the pen. No, there's more to it than that. He's known for violent outbursts, domestic altercations. He nearly killed a kid over some stupid gambling feud. The problem is, his family made him untouchable, even to the police. And Evelyn was okay with all of this? She... always tried to see the good in people, give him the benefit of the doubt. You could say that's just being naive or even stupid, but I think she was just... innocent. Tell me about Evelyn. She was beautiful, carefree, loved to have a good time. I met her during my internship for a private transportation and logistics firm here in Shanghai. She was a great pilot, too. Knew how to feel the currents, to push the bird just so. Too bad her talents for reading the wind didn't translate to reading guys. 
How so? She was always getting into trouble with the wrong crowds. And it always had to do with some boy. She knew I didn't like him, her boyfriend at the time, Lee. It drove a wedge between us, and when we parted ways, it wasn't amicable. I understand. She was a good girl, Jensen. She deserved better. Okay. So, Carter, we're gonna accept. Okay, I'll help. What do you need me to do? My lead. He works for Lim. He's a systems technician who apparently has access to their entire database. He's willing to hand over a copy of Evelyn's autopsy report. So you want me to meet him and get the report? Is that it? Yes, but he'll only respond to a certain phrase. Death and life have their determined appointments. To which he'll reply, riches and honors depend upon heaven. Christ, Malik, this is starting to sound like something out of a bad spy movie. I know. He's just trying to protect himself. I didn't pick the damn quote. So just play along and remember the line, okay? You'll find him inside the lobby of the Lower Hengsha Lim Clinic. Does this guy have a name? None that I know of. But he apparently goes by the handle Anonymous X. I know, I know. Anonymous X. Okay. Anything else? Yeah, before I forget, everything concerning Evelyn's... incident? Newspaper articles, the police report, limb details, it's all inside pod 009 here in the hotel. You should read over everything if you can. Pod 9. Got it. I need to go. Contact me with any updates and... Thank you. I really appreciate this, Jensen. Okay. Um, so first things first. <laughs> My, uh, mouse is about to die, so I just need to plug it in, so... <laughs> Whoops! Okay, yay, mouse plugged in. Okay, so... I feel like... The pod's... Pri oh, the pod is the secondary objective. Okay. Okay, so technically I feel like I want to go to the secondary objective first. I'm assuming the side quest is not going to suddenly disappear the minute I do this. I don't know. See, that makes me nervous just because that one side quest I never got to do disappeared after I finished a main quest mission. My visit to Prague was related exclusively to the project Everyone's calm? Oh, no, you're still freaking out. Everyone here? No, wait. Is everyone freaking out? Everyone's still freaking out. Look at that. Another. Evelyn Carmichael, a young woman in her early 20s, became one of the latest victims claimed by the deadly Yao Jiao rooftops that have authorities clambering for stricter safety in regulation and zoning permits. Sources close to the victim say Evelyn had been out celebrating with her boyfriend before the incident occurred. A witness, whose identity was not released, claimed she slipped and fell while descending one of the many staircases that connected the, the Yao Jiao, not Yao, Yo Jiao and Kui Gan rooftops with Pan, Pandong Street below. Police believe alcohol or drugs may have influenced the fatal accident, but officials claim the tragedy could have been avoided entirely if laws were different. With elections just around the corner, Evelyn's death will no doubt speak a host of new debates and controversy concerning, concerning citywide safety regulations. Rooftops, related injuries, and deaths have steadily risen in the last five years and make up over 60% of all recorded accidental fatalities each year. 
Question is, how many of those are not actually? <laughs> is everyone still freaking out? Everyone's good? You're good? Money? Who's, who's leaving their money here, guys? Please. Sorry, I just now I need to take a closer look. Oh, so forgot. I need to look at the. Here we go. Uh, Fly Girl. The Limb Clinic contact has agreed to meet you tonight. I don't know how large or small this window of opportunity is or how long it will remain open to us, but it's the only thing we have to go on. Hopefully, we can trust him. He holds the biggest piece of this puzzle. I'm sorry I can't be of any more help on this. As much as it pains me to see Lee walk, my hands are tied. If my supervisor found out I was even talking about this, he'd have my badge. I've attached a copy of the police report filed on the night of the incident. The original transcript has been practically gutted by IID, as you will no doubt see the autopsy report should help fill in the blanks. You owe me a pocket, secretary. Uh, incident, 23-year-old Caucasian female, dead on arrival. Uh, from probable fall downstairs, only witness his boyfriend who was found at scene. Severe head trauma, cranial lacerations, internal bleeding, swelling, likely cause of death. Uh, on citation, at approximately 11.49, personnel from the LHPF responded to a distress call from suspect, Li Hong. Upon arrival at the scene, the responding officer witnessed victim... Evelyn Carmichael on the ground near victim was unresponsive. First response EMT unit on scene pronounced victim deceased at approximately 2 in the morning. Victim was transported to blah 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 for further evaluation and possible treatment. Suspect wearing a shirt covered in what appeared to be victim's blood was questioned by responding officer Sergeant Maji. Suspect was visibly distressed, claiming victim had been drinking prior to the incident that had fallen. fallen. Uh, suspect was tested, confirming suspicions of intoxication. Suspect was then detained and transported to <laughs> so, many, so many blackouts for further questioning after EMT cleared him for release. Suspect later claimed the incident occurred moments before call to LHPF emergency roughly between 11.40 and 11.45. Further screening and urinalysis revealed narcotic element exit 9 in suspect system. Suspect remained in custody until before being released. Forensics evidence at the scene turned up inconclusive data to support suspect's claim. Blood spatter analysis concluded that while blood cast-off patterns match those of a fall, there was no evidence of a low to medium velocity impact spotter to match victim's wound and the probable cause of death, blunt force trauma, blunt, blunt force head trauma, and intracranial hemorrhaging. Further investigations into the case are suspended until post-mortem post evaluation and autopsy is concluded at blank. Uh, pending further evidence, suspect is cleared to prosecution. Formal charges are otherwise by order of attorney. All right. Um. But many people believe that your Arctic Ocean installation is more rich. The car park. This uncertainty. When will we be able to see the truth for ourselves? As soon as the installation is complete. If you would like to hear more of my exclusive interview with Hugh Darrow, log on to www.pikeup.com. <laughs> you can see the moment they stop freaking out. Reporting to you live from Pikeup. It doesn't happen often. Okay, I'm going to assume I, I'm still going to be able to have access. Yeah, I'm really just looking for... Uh, 
Okay. And it's time that we as a species stepped up to make things better. Our best chance at doing So, it yeah. Here's what's going to happen. I'm going to do the main mission here. And, and assuming it's not going to make everything else disappear. If not, then I can just go back to a previous save. As soon as the installation is complete. God. If you would like to hear more of my exclusive interview with you, Daryl, should I look at everything, see if there's... Oh my god, this is there's too many things. There's too many things around. <laughs> and I want to look for every credit I can find. <laughs> is so, did she just say, I like this? Dear Diary, some kids banged on my door and taunted, taunted me today. They yelled... He Kikamori and shut in and banged and scratched and kicked to get my attention. I think they belong to a woman down the hall. I am repulsed by their guttural accent. Today was a good day. I sat in my usual place, but this time I was content to look out the window. The people look so sad and lost. I pity them when I'm not angry. Someone rang my phone at 4.18 p.m. today. It came as a shock because no one is supposed to bother me. I spent most of my day trying to figure out if it was a mistake or on purpose. I do not like days like that today. They make me nervous and confused. Today I am cold and cannot warm up. Very cold. I made a bowl of miso soup, but it did nothing. Sometimes I wonder if my blood is thinner than other people. My neighbor was making a lot of noise last night. He plays his satanic satanistic music at an infernal volume. I think he does it to drown out the sound of him be beating his girlfriend. If I didn't have to stay here, I would teach him some manners. I think he is from Central Asia. There is a part of me that really likes his music. <laughs> okay. So there's like a hodgepodge of different... It's a mixture of different nationalities. So that guy was Japanese. See, so every time, every time since I found like that one credit underneath a box, I'm like, oh god. God, every single box, I must check every single box. Staircase. Uh, hi. Okay, gun. <laughs> Saw nothing. You okay? Everyone else is calm, you know. You can stop. You can stop now. Okay, let's read this pocket secretary if there's anything in here to read. Oh, wait. No go. Hive security. From hive security to brass knuckles. Needless to say, the DH is extremely disappointed in you, as I am. I told you this was a dirty job. How can you expect to become a 426 if you can't deal with one little woman? Not good. About that little collection job... Oh. Oh, this is... My visit to Prague was related exclusively okay. to the project which has consumed all of my attention these days. You're referring to the Pangea project, the cooperative program that executed is in serious trouble in life. What? Oh, I thought it was a... Oopsies. I thought it was a rare fire kit that I was looking at. Okay, that's my objective there. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. So, hopefully this does not erase the optional objective that I've got going here. And then we can just get this done. Forget it, man. You're not my type. This isn't a booty call, Van Bruggen. This is about you and some friends of yours I met in Detroit. Detroit? Yeah, okay. I got it now. You had Seraph, right? You were there when I had to pull the plug. So you admit it. You were running a mole. The heck, man. Just the heck. Worst decision I ever made taking that gig. As you can obviously see. You attack my people, Windmill. 
You hope to walk away from this, you tell me what you know. Down, boy. I've got no allegiance to that backstabbing bitch who hired me. Especially after she painted a target on my back. The girl you want is Zhao Yunru, Tai Young Medical CEO. Tai Young Medical? They're Sarah's biggest competition. How do you think they got that way? Zhao doesn't like competition, see? So she uses hack attacks, blackmail, extortion, anything she can do to destabilize it. No offense, but Sarif was just the latest in a long line. You got any proof of this? There's a surveillance recording in the Tai Young Tower. I stashed it on the server in case I ever needed an insurance policy. Not a very smart place to hide it, seeing as you don't work there anymore. Things got hot before I could move it. And now, I got you to get it for me. Of course, you can't just walk into that place. You're gonna need an employee card encoded with your biometrics to use the TYM shuttle. Let me guess. You're gonna tell me where to get one. Hey, I'm always prepared. There's a certain security guard likes to dabble with the ladies. <laughs> You'll find him at the Hong Hua Hotel top floor corner room. Sneak in, snatch the card while he's otherwise engaged and bring it back here so I can code it with the biometrics in your passport. I was there when you flatlined that Mo Van Bruggen. You think I'm gonna trust you? You have to if you want that evidence. Now run along, Sarif man. And don't get too distracted watching the action. I was say, he seemed pretty calm. <laughs> okay. Now he runs back to freaking out. Technically that alarm is still going off somewhere. Yeah, everyone's still freaking out. <laughs> now everyone's calm, okay. Anything, uh... Nope, okay, just thought I'd check. You never know. Okay, is there anything else to look at down here? We didn't really have a good, thorough look. Everything I've got, real cheap. What do you got? What is this? What is this? Where are you selling? I'm so confused. Okay. Oh, hello, Drake Wolf. Millionaire Hugh Darrell has contacted me personally to deny allegations of involvement in a secret United Nations meeting about the augmentation report. Here's what the man had to say. My visit to Prague was related exclusively to the project which has consumed all the storage closet. Hi. <laughs> Wait. Are you guys saving now? You're green. You assume bodyguard. Ah, you buy or sell? Okay. I do it all. Look at a computer and see for yourself. Okay, actually, what is all the this one? The first few games I was interested in playing, but never did because everything was gold yellow. <laughs> that was an interesting reason. Give him weapons. Have an extra weapon that you don't mind giving away. Just tip. Sorry, give who weapons? Okay, what do you got in your store? Revolver ammo. Stopworm. Exploding round package? What? What's that for? I don't need it. What's for the revolver? Maybe I do need it. <laughs> I 
The guy you were just in there will be a story point where you can optional what you see. You know what? I actually, I feel like I recall that from, I have seen Let's Plays of this, but it's been a super long time, but I think I recall that. Ooh, ooh. By the way, I, there's no room in my, <laughs> there's, there's no room in my, what can I sell? Painkillers, what ammunition do I have that I can sell? I've still, well, I have tried, mm, I have tried the pep, which, it didn't really knock him unconscious, so I'm wondering if I should just sell that, because, sun gun, pistol, pistol, revolver, I mean, honestly, if there's a weapon I can give away, it would be the pistol, assuming that that's not, wait, Hmm. That's going to be the pep. Because I used it once and I don't know. The fact that it just, um... Because it didn't knock him unconscious. May result in target falling unconscious. Okay. So, it's possible but it's not a guarantee. Which doesn't... Where have you seen Let's Plays of this game? I think the time the person I was watching was... Center Strain 01? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Center Strain 01. And I th actually, if I, was, I was probably only his uh, playthrough that I watched. He is. I say his specialty would be stealth gameplay, gameplays. Or he's very good at stealth, he's very into stealth. So, especially games that revolve stealth. It's, a uh, more fun to watch him. <laughs> okay. Stop worms. Okay, so clearly I want to buy this. Rate of fire. What is rate of fire? You know what? I don't understand. Number... Increases the number of bullets fired per second. Okay. Well, very much, I want to buy this for the revolver. Yeah, I will be right here. Combine with the revolver. Look at that. Let's examine this. Okay. Oh boy. Um. Do I always have this much room? Pistol ammo, pistol ammo. Machine... Machine pistol ammo. I don't have a machine pistol. So yeah, I can sell that. I might just pick up a machine pistol if I have to give a gun in a way. Or I could give him the pep thing. Cause, uh, I'm not feeling it. Okay. Back to it. Sorry, I need to sell my See what I got. Nope. Sorry, sell. An idiot. Go this way. Stun gun. Where is it? Machine pistol. <sighs> nope. One down. Not that it gives us much. <laughs> and. See, I'm buying... Okay, so what I got? I mean, I could buy revolver ammo, which I feel like I want to... I do feel like I want to buy at least... It's because I don't have... I don't know when it's going to come up. Or I could hold off. There's also rate of fire. Oh, this is only 250? Yeah, I could... I could totally buy that. Likelihood of using mines is not going to be there. Uh, stop worm. Nuke. Okay, I can always... 
Right? I can always come back if I need to buy ammo, right? Yeah, I will be right here. Sure you will. Alright, oh, wasn't aware there was a... Oh, anything behind here? No. Disappointed. Okay, I want to see... Where's the entrance? Because I couldn't hack into that one place. Here we go. Save. Oh! Dude? Yeah, we're definitely not gonna do that now. He's just standing there. Are you stuck? Okay. You're not patrolling guard, are you? I think he was just stuck. Which is weird. That is really weird. Okay. I don't imagine I have any Praxis points more for... Yeah, I don't. Okay. See, I'm so rusty with this that it's, I kind of feel like I'm back to square one. Um, hmm. The hard part about this... That or I just nuke it, right? Because even though my detection is 45, I've been detected so many times already. You know what? Just for safe. We're gonna nuke that. Definitely wanna f if I claim this, I want to fortify both of these. Okay, you know what? Let's just go for it. Because I don't wanna. I don't want to go for the the special thing. Okay, there is no windows here, right? Go, oh, thank God. <laughs> All right. My diary by <laughs> Cho Jian. I am so tired of this place. Day in, day out, solving problems for a bunch of whiny losers. Fix my sink. Unblock my toilet. I'll tell you dumbasses what. Don't flush dope baggies and bottle caps down the john and it won't overflow. I did a graduate degree in engineering for this. I've just got to get out of this place. This shitty hotel is really getting me down. All I've got to do is save enough money to get out of here and I'll never have to see this place again. Two more years, that's it, and then I'm gone. It'll be goodbye, lower Hung Sha, hello sunshine and fresh air. Had to fix Dung's front door again. This makes the third time in two weeks. He keeps coming home drunk, unable to find his keys, and then kicks in the door. This place is driving me nuts. I cannot wait to get out. Oh. Oh, <laughs> let's uh, be careful there. I didn't realize <laughs> there is no window, but there is an open door. Dragon Head's the triad of 21st century, a traditional form. The original eightfold rank structure among the triads became more streamlined in the modern era, era with such traditions as the 36 great oaths of fealty falling out of favor to be replaced with less ornate, more immediate pledges to loyalty. The contemporary four-tiered system reflects the flexibility of the triad criminal enterprise, with a mixture of numeral designators and or traditional honorifics assigned to given roles. At the very lowest level are the probationary members often drawn from youth gangs, these so-called blue lanterns becoming a rank and file 49 after initiation 
ceremony. Above them are key administrators and enforcers, the white paper fan, 415, the red pole, 426, and the straw sandal, 432. A common level, a command level command, <laughs> a command level comes the vanguard, deputy mountain master, and incense master, each at 438. And finally, the mountain master known as the dragon head, 489. Three. <sighs> Another one of these ones. I don't feel confident. <laughs> I do not feel confident at all of getting that one. I'm going to be coming back here, right? So I will be have more chances. This is see, this is a lower security rating. <laughs> the safe, the safe has a lower security rating. Hmm. So you can come at me from either end. I'm going to nuke this one. Okay, for a minute there, I'm like, did I press it? It's not going. Access granted. Yay. And I got the new nuke virus back. Ooh, that's very loud. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, the credits. Okay. Mmm. I'll come back for this. Hopefully I'll remember to come back for that. Security level three. All right. Okay. So wait. I need to head out this way anyway. <laughs> yeah, I haven't streamed for some time. Um, you weren't here in the beginning, but it was a combination of just my hands feeling really tired from work, also playing No No Grands. Strangely enough. Apparently holding a pencil for long periods of time is not that great. Also, it's really hot. It's the reason why I'm actually streaming much earlier today. is a way for me to beat the heat, so to speak. I'm considering doing streams on Tuesday, Thursday, though that's going to be in the evening my time, so... Just because I've delayed, mainly because I feel like I've delayed this game a bit too long. But I feel like this is a game where I definitely need my full concentration, but if I'm dying from the heat, it's going to get very difficult. So today it's going to get 30 degrees Celsius, and then tomorrow's 34, 35 degrees Celsius. It's like, please, can you just, weather, can you calm down a bit? <laughs> okay, limb clinic. Thank God's nearby. Okay. Um, da 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 da. Eh? Excuse me, do you know where the limb clinic is? Hey, I'm trying to find the same place. <laughs> and it's time that we as a species stepped up to 40 degrees? Ugh. Question, is the 40 degrees and humid? Because humidity, that's what, that's the real catch. <laughs> if it's humid and it's hot, then you're definitely going to feel worse. <laughs> Okay, so, I don't know which... Which guy am I talking to? Sorry. Uh, going back to the objectives. Uh, meet the limb clinic contact. 
Okay, so I was told that we're going to meet them in the lobby here. Kind of looks like you're shaking your head at me. <laughs> oh. Anonymous X, hey? Okay, oh boy. 82 degrees Fahrenheit. What? <laughs> Fortunately, I need that in Celsius. I don't have my phone to... to <laughs> don't have my phone with me right now to be able to translate, translate, to convert that into Celsius. <laughs> Because, yeah, Canada, Celsius, actually, I think, I don't know, most of the world, would, is it most of the world Celsius? Actually, don't know. Because, I'm trying to think, who else, who else in the world uses Fahrenheit? <laughs> okay, uh, I'm right now trying to recall, you know what, hopefully... I'll recognize the code word saving now if I screw Can't up. Can't you see I'm busy? Go bother someone else. Professional? Death and life have their determined appointments. What? Oh, uh, and riches and honors depend upon heaven. Very good. Right, what now? Shh. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Meet me outside the clinic. Turn left from the front and go down the stairs. I'll be waiting at the corner. Okay. I kind of lucked out on that. I was expecting to see, like, full quotes, but... <laughs> I got something else. Okay, I'm gonna meet them downstairs. Do I have enough... Did I buy all the Praxis kits? I'll do this and then I'll check. Yes, America is Fahrenheit and inch and inch the rest of the world is M and MM. <laughs> What's fun? 28 degrees Celsius. Celsius. It appears that I may have to retract an earlier statement. Millionaire Hugh Darrow has contacted me personally. Okay. Where are you, dude? Of involvement in secret United Nations meetings about the augmented time is it? Over here. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm standing around. I'm standing right in front of me. You don't need to do I'm that. I'm relieved to know they sent a professional, at least. That makes two of us. Right. Well, though not exactly what I was expecting. I was told I would be meeting a girl. How do I know you're not an imposter or some sort of double agent? Don't think I don't know this could all just be an elaborate trap to set me up. Look, no offense, Mr. X, or whatever your name is, but I really don't have time for this. So if you could simply just give me what I came for, I'll be on my way. Yes, yes. I have it right here. Evelyn Carmichael's autopsy report. Here, take it. Thank you. I trust you will put this information to good use, because accountability and justice is at an all-time low, I'm afraid. It pains me to see this once great city, which stood as a bastion for reform and progress against our oppressive communist origins, succumb to the trappings of corporate bureaucracy and petty corruption. Corruption so often typical of your Western governments. Whatever you say. Now, if you don't mind, I really must be going. Well, there is still the matter of my payment. One thousand credits was the agreed-upon price, I believe. Isn't that right? Oh, what? <laughs> Does anything bad happen if I refuse? <laughs> Also, I don't recall. I feel like Malik would tell me about payment. A little piece of advice, and then what were you just saying about corruption? <laughs> Can I refuse? What happens if I refuse? I'm just gonna... I can't save? I can't save? Ooh. This guy ain't gonna come back at me, is he? Oh, so yeah. How much money do I have? I just got the thousand dollars. I don't know. I mean, I sort of don't want to shortchange this guy. 
the same time money <laughs> 2000 how much is a praxis kit I'm assuming the little advice is that he will you get payments before you hand over the stuff I don't know 2000 or 5000 If I remember correctly, 2,000 or 5,000. Ah. Ah. Sorry, dude. I need the money. So, for my own adventure, misadventures. Oh, so, Malik. You gotta tell me. Girl, you gotta tell me if I have to, if payment was involved. You can't just leave me like that. A little piece of advice. When attempting to restore money from someone, don't give them what they want before trying to rip them off. What? What? You... you mean you aren't going to pay? But I risked everything to get you that file! Chalk it up to a learning experience and move on. You... you... you scoundrel! You'll regret this... someday. You just... you just mock my words! See you later, X. I feel bad now. <laughs> I really do feel bad. I never should have trusted you. You, you worse than a... You're all the same, you know that? Nothing but petty liars and common criminals. All of you. Okay, how much money do I have? How much does the practice get? Millionaire Hugh Darrell has contacted me personally. See, I'm tempted. I saved. Right? Did I save beforehand? <laughs> oh, no. You need practice software? Neuropathine? Something else? Look at computer. Oh, I must have already. Oh no, 5,000. <laughs> You'll come back if you change your mind. Okay, I do feel bad about not paying that guy. I really do. I, I kind of want to go back just to pay that guy. Because, <laughs> I mean, he was doing Malik. Well, not really doing him a, doing her a solid because expecting payment, but... I know this seems silly, but I feel I, like I feel bad not paying. <laughs> Even though, it, even though it probably doesn't really matter Malik. that much. Quick save. Previous auto save. My quick save was. Okay, so I think this is just the conversation before. Okay, I know this is gonna seem really dumb, but I would, I I, I feel bad shortchanging that guy. <laughs> um, assuming this is it. <laughs> I know this seems. Yeah, okay, there goes. See, I saved beforehand. Can't you see I'm busy? Go bother someone else. Okay, so... What are you? Death and taxes. Nice hat. Death and life have their determined appointments. What? Oh, uh, and riches and honors depend upon heaven. Very good. Right, what now? Shh. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Oh, sorry. I was pre I pressed exit clinic. just to see if I can Turn skip this. From the front and but I guess because the I haven't seen, I've I'll seen it, technically the haven't seen it before in game. Because it doesn't register. Okay. There's a few ways of making fast money, not picking up weapons for ammo, but selling the ones you have. 
not upgraded if upgraded then just drop and take the one you want to sell and sell each type go back repeat until every weapon is gone then pick up yours and voila fortunately the problem with that that's like so time consuming sorry so time consuming in terms of it was not going to really make for fun <laughs> Friend playing, here. watching someone play. Hi. Oh, no. Yes. I'm relieved yes, to I'm know right they sent a professional, at least. That makes two of us. Right. Well, you're not exactly what I was expecting. Okay. I was told I would be meeting a girl. How do I know you're not an imposter or some sort of I double know. agent? I, I feel like I want to try don't talking think I don't over know while this could happening, all just but I don't know if you guys can hear me over this guy because no there's Mr. a lot of talking happening X, right now. Or whatever your name is, but I really don't have time for this. So if you could simply just give me what I came for. I'll be on my way. Yes, yes. I have it right here. Evelyn Carmichael's autopsy report. Here. Take it. Thank you. I it trust you will true. put this information it was tedious, to good use. But it made so much because money. accountability and justice is at an all-time low. See, that's the hard low, part afraid. when, like, it pains me when you're to playing see this once on great stream, city, so to speak. which like, stood as a bastion for reform and progress so much against our oppressive communist you just, origins, you just have succumbed to, to the trappings of corporate yeah, I mean, bureaucracy and petty better. corruption. I don't know if you can Corruption hear me so as I'm trying to talk over your this guy, but... <laughs> Whatever you say. Now, if you don't mind, I really must be going. Well, there is still the matter of my payment. One thousand credits was the agreed-upon price, I believe. Isn't that right? Malik, you owe me. And what were you just saying about corruption? A deal is a deal. Surely your handlers informed you of this little detail. No, no. my handlers failed to mention this little detail. It, never mind. Just take your money. This report better be worth it. Oh, I assure you it is. Whoever it was that didn't want this information given to the proper authorities paid a lot of money to have it ignored. A pity for them, limb policy strictly prohibits deletion of records concerning operational procedures. For legal purposes, you see. Legal, right. Nice doing business with you, X. I trust you'll show the utmost discretion with this most sensitive of data, yes? I love how he's like, I don't know, he's just looking at you and he's clicking on his thing. Now, it's kind of weird. I that sandwich? <laughs> I have a mind to confront that delinquent Yao once again. Okay. <laughs> right, let's read this. Now let's read this report. Um, mental note, after extraction, remove all traces, all that is necessary for the triumph of evil. All that is necessary for the triumph of evil is that good men do nothing. Okay, Evelyn Carmichael, time of death, 10-15, craniocerebral injuries, scalp, contusion, linear pattern of lacerations of right side of the skull, linear pattern of lacerations of cerebral hemisphere, subarachnoid, sub, subarachnoid, I don't know what that is, and subdural hemorrhage, uh, small contusions, tips of temporal lobes, abrasions of left cheek, Abrasion contusion, posterior left shoulder, abrasion of right lower back and posterior right lower leg, toxicology, blood ethanol not detected. She was not, no drugs or no alcohol in her system. Clinopathologic correlation. Cause of death of this 23 year old female is asphyxia by seizure associated with cranial cerebral trauma and intracranial hemorrhaging. Addendum. Quantitative blood tests reveal a high level of HCG in the subject's bloodstream, a hormone produced during the early stages of pregnancy. Further examination confirmed the presence of first trimester fetal development. Oh boy. Oh boy. Malik, I just got the autopsy report. No drugs or alcohol in Evelyn's system. And her estimated time of death doesn't fit Lee's story. She did die from a head wound, but not one that matches the evidence found at the scene. I knew it. It couldn't have been just an accident. There's more. Evelyn was pregnant. Malik? I'm here. I... We can't let him get away with this, Jensen. He's guilty. He has to be. Can you go to his apartment? And do what? Get proof. Get... something. I'm sending you the coordinates. Contact me again when you're there. Okay, find Lee's apartment. Lee's apartment doesn't seem that far. Doesn't seem to be that far. Oh. Have I? Hi. My 
<laughs> Hi. No one's. This isn't the belong to anyone, right? Go. You're a fan of the Panchea project. I won't say it again. The global initiative that aims at healing our world. Earth's ecosphere is in serious trouble, Eliza. Too late to hide. That we as a species stepped up to make things better. What? Was that him? To modify ocean temperatures through a combination of iron seeding and geothermal management. Forgive me, Mr. Darrow, but many people believe that your Arctic Ocean. Sorry, wait. Was that someone? When will we be able to see the truth? Was that him talking to me? If you would like to hear more of my exclusive interview with Hugh Darrow, log on to www.pikesweb.com. This is Eliza Kassan reporting to you live. Okay, well, save. It doesn't happen often, folks, but it appears that I may have to retract an earlier statement. Okay, I can't hack that. What the? Wait, where? Oh, oh, what? What is this? This is disgusting. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I feel like that, I'm at least going to need a few. I'm gonna need. I'm definitely gonna need some stops, stop worms and nukes for that one. Again, it's like there's a two entry point way for the the detection system, which makes me really not want to attempt it. Oh, hi. Okay, fine. You're cool with this, right? <laughs> You're cool with that, right? Did you, you didn't see anything? You did not see anything. Okay. Anything behind here? Can I go behind here? There is combat rifle ammo. Okay, something I can sell. More things I can hack. Oh my god, there's so many. There are so many of these. Actually, they even see. There is something underneath. What does it say? Yeah, sure. 9900. Get rid of this message once you see it. Bole Bole Shei Guo told me you have the code to the safe in the mini storage. Can you send? The boss needs me to pick it up. Okay, so this is for the this is for the safe here. Uh, oh, I don't need to hack it. Never mind. Uh, Auto Prog Plague Plague Two Two One Three Activity on Channel. Okay, wait. Is everything in place? Almost. What do you mean almost? I've spoken with Montreal. The broadcast satellites are ours when we need them. A few weeks. When we when we need them. A few weeks of discomfort, and the public will be primed for our recall. Nicholas. We control their purse strings, they will do as we say. I still think we should wait for the referendum. We can't afford to wait. America's science board conveys, conveys next month. But the mood among the delegates is shifting and pos I'm positive that given more time, no, by going public with the discovery, Seraph is forcing our hand. 
The world will not change overnight just because David Seraph wills it. Besides, we can do nothing until our biochip is ready. I thought you said you were close. Finding the correct nerve interface has proven more challenging than anticipated. Fortunately, thanks to David, I now know where to look. Okay. I do know there is something where there is a update that people would like you to get, and I already know not to go for it. But <laughs> just saying that now because of the previous the previous let's play that I saw. Um, another thing that I that's one I definitely remember. Anyway, L eight R tonight I am taking nuclear snake down bastard sly. I'll give him that. Throwing a Shea five up against my latest infill. But ain't no corp firewall in the world to keep the windmill out. Is this... Hey Dutchie, you get a chance, swing by, you gotta see the tranny I just decrypt. Okay. What's this? Yeah, this one I... No idea. Okay. So we technically have the code for this. What is... Ooh. Okay, this is super easy to hack. <laughs> that was Access granted. <laughs> that was nothing. <laughs> Code what? Who needs that? What is this? Revolver. <gasps> Thank you. I'm so happy I did not buy revolver ammo then. Anything underneath here? No. What about here? No. Okay. Make a mess. Uh, yeah. This search is open now. Hmm. Our best chance of doing this is to modify ocean temperatures through a combination of iron seeding and geo Now, I'm tempted to make an attempt for this one. But many people believe that your Arctic Ocean Where's the security guy? Okay. Saving. You're gonna stay there, right? You don't come any further than this. Yeah, okay. Okay. You shouldn't be here, sir. Get moving. It doesn't happen often. Where? But it appears that I may have to retract an early statement. You know what? Either way, that guy's coming back. I don't know, it makes me nervous. I, I'm assuming it is them. At the very least, let's get this, uh... Is there a reason? Okay. <laughs> Okay. She's not gonna question that we opened the door to that place, but she is gonna question that. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to check the map. Okay, so either way, I think we're both heading... This is both in the the Yao the I keep pronouncing it wrong. The Yo Jiao. It's not Yao. It's Yo.
And it looks like I'm really close to another getting another praxis point, so. Checking the map. Okay. So I just need to get above to upper floors. where I'm heading right now. Anything underneath? No. Yeah. What is this? Ammunition count. Okay, hold on. <laughs> uh oh, I totally forgot I had this. Come what can I combine this with? My revolver or my pistol? Sweet. Rate of fire. And then, what's the rate of fire in this one? I think they're exactly about the same. This one's four. Okay, yeah. Let's uh let's increase the rate rate of fire of my uh, revolver. And then we can pick up this ammunition count. Now, what can the guy combine this with? It's only reaching these two weapons. Uh, sorry. Examine. What is my ammo capacity? My ammo capacity from pistols kind of shit. <laughs> and the ammo capacity for this one is also... I mean, hmm. I'm assuming I'm going to get more, right? I think I, I want to increase the ammo capacity for the pistol. Just because, I mean, this packs a bigger punch. So as long as I'm not, my aiming is not bad. If I hit them, I'm going to get them. This one may take a few more hits, which makes me want to increase the, uh, the ammunition count. I don't know if that logic makes sense, but... <laughs> uh, are you interested in the Cyberpunk 2077 game? Only FPS I'm considering buying. Uh, OTS way more than FPS, but yeah, I get it. It's, it's definitely a game where it's like, I will buy this when it's on sale. Maybe. We'll see. But yeah, that's definitely one that's look, that looks interesting. Okay, so I'm going to increase the ammunition count for my pistol. Did I, hello? Click, 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 click. Come on. Here we go. All right. Okay, anything underneath here? No. What? Okay, so this is just to grab stuff. Wait, I have the Icarus landing system, don't I? I could technically just jump off. Yes! I totally forgot. <laughs> 
Who needs ladders? All right. So let's see. Okay, so hmm. where am I? Where there's stairs? There's stairs. Actually, wait. I'm on the same. Oh, I am on this. It says I'm on the same level. Oh, you know what? I'm on the same level now, but the minute I go down here, back, then it's going to place me... Oh no, it's still placed me... Oh yeah, yeah, sorry. That was... Okay, that's two levels. Okay, so... Downtown Apartments? Is that where he is? It would make sense. So am I going up here again? They wouldn't have put people back, would they? Like, I see a way that there is to... Whoa, what the... What did I just jump on? Okay, this doesn't look like there's a way for me to get anywhere over here. Damn, okay. Because I'm assuming the, those apartments are the one that's all blocked off. Oh, here we go. Ah, they're still unconscious. Okay. Hello. Machine pistol. Can sell that later. Anything here? Not really. Nope. <laughs> I wouldn't even be able to pick it up. I'm assuming I'm in the right place. No. So this is a completely different area. Okay. Man. So far, me just trying to... Yeah, I'm all like on the direct opposite end. Okay, if I just jump down... Not here. Let's not jump down here. Here? Okay, at the very least, let's get closer. I don't think I actually, you know what, I say that, but then I don't think there's anywhere for me to get closer to. Okay.
Nope. Just wanted to see. I thought I was thinking, like, is that jumpable? I can't tell. I don't think it is, though. Okay. Actually, let's back up. Okay, oh, another one with a... Uh... Actually, the only... The main entry point way would be through here. No, missed it. Don't know if I want to go for it. Access granted. Yeah. Didn't think I would have made it anyway, but. <laughs> yes. Ammunition count. And money. Anything underneath here? No? Okay, well... Combine this one with my revolver. Oh, I press examine. My bad. I meant... Co no, combine? Combine with revolver. There we go. I already checked this one, right? There's nothing underneath here? Okay, just make sure. God, I need to open every single one. Okay. Oh, I don't think I haven't been in this area, so I'm going to explore. Not that there's much here to explore. Hi. You don't look like you're that desperate. Oh, and then, oh, this, okay. Where does this take me, though? So many ladders. Okay, save. Um... Alright, this is just a place people hang out. Hang out. Is this his apartment right here? I would assume it is. Oh, that, that's his apartment right there. Okay. So... Let's break into this one. Security rating of one. That's that's doable then. Okay, and I can't hack the. Saving. Close the door. It's a small apartment. Anything in here? Invasive brain machine interfaces. 
uh, by Hugh Darrow. Invasive Brain Machine Interfaces, BMI, which are most common in North America research, differ mainly from EEG-based interfaces by the method through which neural activity is recorded. While EEGs can record neural activity from outside the skull, invasive BMIs require the implantation of an electrode within the brain itself. In principle, invasive BMIs rely on the hypothesis that groups of neurons will modulate their activity in very similar ways. Each time a given action is performed through individual neuron firing varies from trial to trial. A clinically viable BMI should be able to document these modulations and use these modulatory behaviors to re reproduce motor actions in artificial actuators. In the 1960s and 70s, the scientists Ebard Hard, E. Fertz, and his colleagues trained the monkeys to coordinate activity of their cortical neurons through biofeedback readings from implanted electrodes. Later, Edward Schmitz, Schmitz <laughs> proposed that cortical neuron, I'm so reading that wrong, cortical? Cortical neural activity could move a prosthetic such as a robotic arm due to limitations in technological development such as the technology necessary to implant sufficient quantities of electrodes into the brain. It took nearly 20 years for researchers to test his hypothesis. In the mid-90s, invasive BMI testing progressed from mice moving a device with a single degree of freedom to primate movement reproduction in monkeys. Researchers were able to produce reaching actualization in which the neural actions of the primate was able to stimulate a robotic arm to feed itself, combining components such as reaching and grasping into a fluid movement. Oh, I already what am I doing? Oh, hello. This is safe in here. And there's credits just How much credit? Oh no, okay, that's my current credit. Nothing underneath. Just making sure. Nothing in the washroom. Okay. Wait, sorry, where's your safe? Here go. Security rating one. All right, what am I looking at here? We have these as well. Okay. Access granted. What is that? Rifle. Okay, that's <laughs> that it looks like a flask, so I'm like, what exactly do you have? Oh hello. There is money sitting behind man. If I wasn't crouched, I would have totally missed that. <laughs> Alright, we got 3,000 credits. And there is some stuff I can sell if I can get back to the Alice Pod Gardens. Save. Okay, hold on. So this is a hack security level 2, I believe I just... Oh, no, three. Mm, read that wrong. <laughs> um, okay, let's see what we've got here. I could, if I wanted to, hack the terminal itself. Oh, wait. No, yeah. It's possible. Access denied. Boo. Okay, I guess I. Oh, right. Well, twenty seconds to putz around. 
This just goes to the Qui-Gon district. I'm curious just where it takes me. <laughs> well, I mean, if it's here, might as well. <laughs> what was the security level too? I totally did not check. Um... Okay, so we- oh, okay, here we go. I was like, do we have any of the nodes? Oh, wait. Okay, what is the path these ones can take? Okay, hmm. What? Missed it. No, I clicked on the wrong thing. Ugh, use Access a stop worm. And I didn't need to. Okay. Not as exciting. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, it's just a tranquilizer. Okay, anything? Whoa! <laughs> Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Holster that, please. There's nothing underneath. Disappointment. All around. Okay, we can go back. Okay. Save. Find Lee. <laughs> I don't know, is he the type to have a weapon? I can hide in the closet if I want to. <laughs> He's in there? Hello? I can't access this. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Malik, I'm inside Lee's apartment. Doesn't look like anyone's home. Damn. Okay, look. Lee isn't smart enough to properly cover his tracks, so look around. Maybe you can find something suspicious. Malik, I think I got a probable murder weapon. A broken clock. The kicker is the hands line up roughly with Evelyn's TOD. Coincidence? That's a hell of a stretch. You really think? If Lee's as dumb as you say, maybe. We'd need lab tech analysis to confirm, but if there ever was a smoking gun, it fits. I'll keep looking. I'm sure there's more here. Why would you keep it, dude? Massa Playa 69? Wow, okay. Oh my god, what am I looking at here?
I mean, this is basically a straight shoot. Okay, I know there's a thing, but access granted. It's going way too quickly. I'm not gonna be able to get it. Liberty in mind, and body. Random walk. Hi, Lee. Your father wanted me to to forward this to you. It's the quarterly report concerning your family's recent investment in Lim. P.S. I'm still waiting on your financial statements from Bell Tower Associates. They're surprisingly tight-lipped when it comes to business, but then again, I'm not surprised. They are privately owned after all. Still considering your father's executive holdings, you think they'd be more forthcoming. P.P.S. We still on for Friday? Donna. Uh, price lowered to the, the, what is this? Maintained at buy? The company reported stronger than anticipated quarterly 427 financial performance. Uh, beating expectations for the fourth quarter in a row, yet we anticipate shares will, will trend lower over the next several weeks and would recommend opportunistic investors to wait for shares to dip into the C145 or C149 per share range before buying aggressively. Valuation. Our target, multiply, our target multiple for the company's share is 25. Da, da, da. Okay, this is, this is all business talk. I don't care. Do not disgrace us. My son, your behavior as of late has been disgraceful. Up until now, I've done everything in my power to support and protect you, but my patience is running thin. If you do not change your embarrassing lifestyle, I will have no choice but to remove you from both the company and family, meaning no more financial support or immunity. You dishonor us with all your, us all with your whoremongering. P.S. Your mother as well, but she is disappointed. I suggest you apologize to her. Send flowers. Malik, it looks like Hong Sr. was upset with Hong Jr.'s behavior and threatened to cut off his inheritance if he didn't stop whoring around. Sounds like he considered Evelyn beneath the family name. And if he knew she was pregnant, I... I can't believe Lee would do something like that just for money. Speaking of money, the Hong family seems heavily invested in both Bell Tower and Lim. That could explain the cover-up and lack of a proper investigation. I'll stick around a bit. I'm sure there's still more to find. I mean, I can believe it. <laughs> I don't know why you are so doubtful. Uh-oh. Malik, I found a baseball bat, but it looks clean. Almost like it's been washed recently. Maybe Lee washed Evelyn's blood off of it. That's what I'm thinking. But I'm not sure it could inflict the type of laceration she had. I'll make one last sweep to make sure I got everything. Okay. Uh... Okay, I apparently can't put that. I was trying to put the fridge back in. Okay, well that's just gonna leave. You know what? It's probably in the washroom. Or not. I'm very disappointed. What? Why do you not have a holder for it? Okay. Um... Anything in the closet? One last sweep, you say? Wait, hold on. Is there anything I can do or do I just leave now? Is there anything else? There's nothing else I can interact with. I mean, his apartment is pretty sparse. Anything behind the door? On the bed itself? Crouch. Oh, here go. Hey, Lee, baby. Can't wait to see you today. But I'm stuck at work. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I'll make it up to you, baby. I promise. I'll meet you at the hive, okay? Just don't get a party. The Hive? I should have guessed Lee would be there. It's pretty much a second home for him. Wait a minute, you heard that? Sorry, Jensen. I don't like invading your privacy like this, but it's important. Plus, this gives me an idea. When you're done looking around Lee's apartment, head to the Hive. Contact me when you're there. 
Okay, I think that's it. I'm heading to the hive now. I doubt we'll find anything else in here without calling in a forensics team. Sounds good. Okay, mission's still going. I have to go back to the hive. It's... hold on. Gain access to Tile Medical. Where is the mission? Okay, it's not here, so we'll be in a different area. Okay, what time is it right now? At the very least, I want to finish off this, um... Are you stuck on there, sir? Nothing was stolen. Oh my god. Figured I can get the key card. So I'm close enough, technically. It's all. Hmm. Which, <laughs> which level am I going to? Down below? It's not just- no, wait, this is where I came from. Oh wait. There's something here. Stun gun darts. Okay, not what I was expecting. Is it me as I just now keep- I, I'm now- I don't know if I'm just noticing all these places now, but they're everywhere. Okay. Ooh. God, this feels like it's taking forever. Access granted. Okay, a lot of stopworms. Not a lot of stopworms, but oh my god, yes. Reload speed. No! <laughs> Wait. Anything underneath? Okay. Ah, uh, the ammo. Okay, either way, let's see. I do need to use one of these though. Um, so. Reload speed? Which ones? Can reload speed for the revolver? I'm really souping up the revolver. <laughs> or it can reload speed the, um, the pistol. You want, know just because. Actually, I can probably temporarily drop this. Okay. Because I see myself using the pistol more. Again, I, as I explained numerous times. Oh, I didn't know you can <laughs> reload speed for the tranquilizer dart. Huh, I didn't know that was a thing. If I knew that, maybe I would have used it. My bad. Oh well, too late. Use it for the pistol. Okay. That's there for the hive. Where? Ah, Huang Hua Hotel is here. Sorry, I'm trying to determine which way I'm heading. This way. What's that? It's just on the ground. Central would like to reward you for being one of our top sellers 
in Hangsha. Mainly, your decision to set up shop in such an unusual location was frowned upon by many, but there's no denying the amount of merchandise you've been able to move. Perhaps love and war truly do have much in common. Expect a bonus in the next drop. Okay. Are they going to know this? Do they care? It's really hard to tell. Hearts of steel crossing the line. Just get out, he raged. Is this just a book? You've had your fun, now get out of here, go back to your brothers and their purity first. Friends, Jace, no. <laughs> she reached out, but he pulled away. You don't understand. Don't insult me, he snapped, gesturing angrily with his augmented arm. This is all some game to you, wasn't it? Playing at me playing at being the rebel, sleeping with the wirehead cogboy, just to piss off your family. Jace pointed a still finger at her, his Okay, I don't know what that says. To hell with you, I'm sick of your lies. Meredith reacted without thinking. Her hand slapped him across the cheek. Shut up, she said in a brittle voice. Don't push me away. Don't pretend this doesn't mean anything. When he looked at her, the hurt in his eyes cut like blades. This, you can't be here. I have to, she breathed. Uh, romance novel? Probably should have saved before doing this, but too late. <laughs> We're here. What is this mess? I realize it technically should go from this side. I didn't realize I already got it. No, let's not go for it. Let's just <laughs> let's just capture this. Access granted. Don't risk it. Don't risk it. Okay. I'll pretend that this chair is hiding me. <laughs> Okay, what do we got here? Ooh! See, I definitely need to get this one at least to fortify it. Nope. Yeah, that really was not gonna go. I wouldn't go upstairs if I were you. Why not? Wait, don't tell me. Me and Edgar going at it again? Yep. And you know what that means. Yeah. Edgar in a bad mood. Shame, too, because he can be sweet when he wants to. I'm always amazed by what May gets away with. Well, Okay. Not exactly a... <laughs> Gorgia. We had to change the code to the safe in the manager's office. Oh, there's that. One of the ladies figured out the old one. Not sure exactly how, but either way, we changed it to 7657. No one's in here, huh? <laughs> okay. 
membership card. Oh, the hive. I can get through the front door now. <gasps> yes. Please and thank you. I don't want to play a thousand dollars. Because I don't want to play a thousand dollars. Sweet. Okay. So now I have a way in, which is awesome. Anyone going to precariously leave stuff around? Oh god. I'm stuck. <laughs> okay. Uh, one thing I do want to check, I want to check behind the screen here. I don't think I did. Nope. Okay, nothing there. Sweet. So we got a membership card. You want... Well, you know what? I have to come back down anyway, and I might just use the code. Okay, sorry. There's a. Oh, don't tell me I left my purse in there with me. Rooftop level. If that's where we need to go, then is this just to the rooftops? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that's just another entryway in. Stop. I told you, no. I am not getting arguments, not for, for this! Our customers would pay much for the services of an augmented girl. You can make a lot of money. They can tell customers to get themselves augmented, and they can go back themselves! Sure, some already have. <laughs> no, end of talking! What the hell is this? Oh boy. Access granted. Oh, oh, oh. Whew. that was that was way too close. <laughs> I was like, I don't want to leave yet, but I like Man, that could. Mm. Hello, I heard you. Stop right there! <laughs> wow, he did not question that at all. You aren't supposed to be here. Did that other guy just die? He got shot instead? What? I didn't know that could happen. Okay. But my bad not being sneaky, but yeah, that's a pool. Wow. That was... <laughs> I guess he's gone. Now. Jensen, you got any news yet? You know I hate being left in the dark. Yeah, I found Van Bruggen. Looks like the Tai Young Medical Corporation hired him and the Mercs to destabilize us. TYM? They already have the lion's share of the global augmentation market. Why use Van Bruggen? in order to get that share. Hopefully I'll be able to prove it once I get this smart card back to Van Bruggen. You need backup, let me know. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, that was really funny. Yeet! Let's <laughs> get out of there. Okay, I do need to get back to that manager's office though. How do I get back to the... Hmm, damn. Okay, no, it's this way. 
So I have the code, so get it. Uh, okay. Hive is here. Wait, where's the entrance to the... Wait, the entrance is all the way over there? Oh no, I just went in a different direction. Okay, sorry, I got turned around. Okay, where the hell... Okay, this way. Wanghua Hotel, there we go. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I probably don't need to crouch, but I'm going to. So I didn't realize that the office I was break the door I was breaking into was the one I needed to break into. You know what? I don't feel like I just don't care right now. <laughs> I really don't. Money. Pistol ammo. And girl. You want best in the city? You come to right place. Look on computer and see for yourself. Oh, I can sell things. I can sell the ammunition, the machine pistol. Okay. Combat rifle, I don't have that either. Sniper rifle, I don't have that either. There we go. Didn't exactly sell a lot, but whatever. Uh, I'm sorry. Rockets? What? <laughs> what do you mean by rockets? I don't... Targets? What in the world? Machine pistol. Interesting. Oh, laser guide. I actually... Ooh. If there's a thing I want the laser guide with, it would be this, the my tranquilizer rifle. Because, dear boy, I'm terrible. With aiming with that thing. And the weapons damage. Okay, well these don't cost... This costs the least. Okay. Yeah. Can I buy both of them? So I, like, I know I can buy both of them, but it's like my inventory space is questionable. Thank you. Come again. Oh, I can only use... Never mind. So I can't... What? I thought you could totally use it. Let's just put it on the pistol. Whatever. Damage output. Combine that. With... Hold on. I want to check... Damage output. So this one's still one, two, three, four, five. My pistol. My pistol is at. Okay. No, let's just put it with the pistol. Oh, okay. Well, that's done over with. Let's um, let's go deal with this guy. I have the hive membership. I'm very happy about that. By the way, Again, sir. Go right in. 
Oh, he doesn't even ask for the card. He just instantly knows. <laughs> he just instantly knows that. Malik, I'm in the hive. What's your plan? Find Lee and talk to him. I want you to convince him you know exactly what he did to Evelyn and why. If you can make him panic, I'm willing to bet he'll spill his guts. Just make it look like blackmail. If he's willing to pay to keep you quiet, he's basically tying his own noose. I'll listen in and record everything. Got it. They're here to put an end to corruption. Okay. So I see this guy laying on the ground. Save. You got a favorite poison? What? Looks like Tong's running a nice operation here. You for hire? Because a suspicious man might not appreciate you asking. A suspicious man might also wonder what kind of job gets handed off to strangers. But all right, I'll bite. What are you offering? I got a problem I need solving. Trouble is, none of my usual guys are available. And this problem? It involves a woman. Someone who owes Tong operation here some money. Getting it out of her is proving to be... difficult. It's a dirty job, but it pays well. You interested? Uh, I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, how bad? How bad is this? <laughs> yeah, I can't even ask for details, right? How bad is this? I'm tempted to decline. As much as as much as I need money, I'm really tempted to decline because I just don't know. I can you can make it to be good, really? Okay. So I can accept it and everything will turn out okay. <laughs> if you say so, I am trusting you on this. Tell me more. I'm listening. That's what I like to hear. This woman, Jaya, she's a broker. Highly competitive field in Hengsha. But without the right skills, her business wasn't doing so well. So we helped her out. Gave her a nice social enhancement upgrade chip so she could understand her clients' needs. Now, it's time to pay us what's due, but she says she won't. So basically, you want me to be your collector? Yes, but it's not as simple as that. The girl's gone into hiding and thinks we won't find her. But she also took her phone and computer along to keep her business alive. Not very smart, assuming you've got the equipment to track those. We don't exactly, but we know someone who does, and that's where you come in. Bao Tower set up a surveillance network around town. A series of relay antennas. I need you to hack them. Three relays should be enough for us to access the database and triangulate Jaya's position. Then I go get your money. Exactly. The first relay is on the rooftop of a four-story building in the Yu Zhao district. I assume you've got an info link and Wayfinder package in those fancy augs of yours? I'll upload the coordinates and then contact you once you've hacked in. I mean, I'm assuming with this, if I don't want to do it, I can just not do it. Either way, we need to find Lee. Wherever this guy is. Oh yeah, don't definitely... Mm. That, that bucket looks very... Oh, hello. Pocket secretary. Almost missed that. Okay, what does the pocket secretary say? Ah, come on. Uh, the bull has been asking questions about our little basement club. Has someone broken the first rule? I hear him or anyone asking, I will find a little snitch and cut off more than just a finger. In the meantime, I'm changing the basement access to 0415. Memorize and delete this missive. You think I can just take that alcohol right in front of him? Okay, I'm gonna save again just because I don't know where. There's a lot of alcohol around. The hive bat. Okay, Lee, where are you? Okay, hold on. Bar tab, just inactive that for now. Just so I can focus on this mission. Oh wait, he's right there. Okay, hold on. What's over here? 
nothing. We can get into the behind the bar. Don't see anything here. Okay, so we're gonna talk to Lee. Uh, let me just make sure what Malak... I found Lee. Time to convince him that I have proof he murdered Evelyn. Hopefully he's as dumb as he looks. Okay, now I just save. I'm gonna save again. All right, let's do what this. What do you want, Chrome Boy? Is your name Lee Hong? Yeah, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. What's it to you? I want to talk to you about Evelyn Carmichael. Ev... Man, it's off. I already told all you knuckles all there is to say. Relax. I'm not with the police. I work private, and you could say I specialize in cases like yours. If you ain't police, then what the fuck you want? A simple proposition. I have proof that shows you murdered Evelyn, and I want you to pay me two and a half million credits to make that proof disappear. Two and a half? Bullshit. You ain't got shit on me, Narco. I ain't paying you shit. I strongly suggest you reconsider. And I strongly suggest you get the fuck out of my face. Because unless you got your proof right here, I ain't got shit to say to you. All right. Let's start with the police report. I know your story doesn't match up with the evidence at the scene of Evelyn's fall. Oh, yeah? And why's that? Because the police report was full of inaccuracies. Because the police report was falsified. Because the police report was full of inaccuracies, like someone deliberately tampered with evidence. Yeah, and? <laughs> that still don't prove shit. Not only does the evidence not add up, but neither does your testimony. You lied about why Evelyn fell down the stairs in the first place. You said you'd both been drinking heavily prior to the accident, and the reason Evelyn fell was because she was drunk. We both know that isn't true. Man, that shit was in the papers. Now, if the evidence doesn't fit, and your story was a lie, then how did Evelyn die on that night? Well, the answer is pretty simple, really. You killed her. But how? Uh, antique clock? By hitting her in the head with that antique clock you keep so prominently displayed in your apartment. The lacerations on her head, the intracranial hemorrhaging, it's the perfect match. In my apartment? How the fuck do you know what's in my apartment? And like any good crime of passion, you needed motivation. Something to fuel your violent outbursts. What did Evelyn say or do to make you murder her? She told you she was pregnant, and you panicked. Faced with the prospect of losing your easy way of life, you struck out at her in anger. How? That's impossible. But now the final piece of the puzzle. Why was Evelyn's death never considered a murder investigation? Because your family, one of the wealthiest and most influential families in Shanghai, covered it up. But whose silence did they buy? Uh... Oh, shit. I... I hope it's this one. Lim, your family's sizable investments oh, is it Bell Tower? Sure. assured the autopsy performed on Evelyn's body would never see the light of day, and her death would simply fall through the cracks of an already crumbling justice system. Fuck this shit, man! And, and fuck you! I can help you, Lee, but only for a price. All right, fuck! I can't believe this shit! I'll pay you, man! I'll pay you just... What do you need from me? Details. Let me hear your side of the story, and then we'll move on from there. I don't... I don't know! Evelyn, that stupid bitch! She was going to ruin me. I... I didn't mean to kill her, okay? Evelyn wouldn't shut up about us, about the baby, so I hit her! I just wanted to make her shut her stupid mouth. But the dumb bitch started freaking out! So I hit her again, and, until I... Until she finally stopped screaming. When I realized what I'd done, I, I panicked. She was barely breathing, so I carried her to the stairs near my apartment and, and dropped her. I had to make sure it looked like an accident. I had no choice. She trapped me. She just wanted my money. 
I would have been ruined. I need to go. We'll be in contact again soon. Huh? What? What about the evidence? And the money? Where the fuck you going? Goodbye, Lee. <laughs> well, he's not dumb. Well, he's not that dumb because he knows something was up there. Um, I think. Malik, on... please tell me you got a recording of all that. Oh my God, Jensen! I could kiss you right now. I can't believe you got him to confess so openly like that. To be honest, it was easier than I was expecting. You were definitely right about Lee. He's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed. Well, don't get too cocky just yet. Before I send our little friend's confession off to the local media and authorities, I want to get some Shanghai street justice first. There's a control panel linked to the hive I need you to hack. Uploading the coordinates now. <laughs> what? Okay, okay, first off, uh, thank you, Gra Grape. Oh my god, Gabe the Grump. We're, oh, uh, I'm sorry, I'm looking at the little doggy animated, I don't know, animated gif emoji. So cute. But, <laughs> um, I feel like even with, if I got that wrong, I mean, they were both with Bell Tower in Lim, but I didn't know if there was one more, but I got everything else right. Because that's more, you know, you kind of already dug up the details of like, this is what you did and you thought no one knew. Haha, <laughs> you're wrong. Alright. So I need to hack into just here? You guys don't care, right? You're busy drinking. Okay. Alright, three security. I have a, quite a few stop worms if it needs to come to that. Mm hmm. Oh, what the? What is this? I'm sorry, is there. There's two of them that I need to. Shoot. Okay. Sorry. Uh Yeah. That was bad. <laughs> I need to be I need to be faster. I think I was just I couldn't click on it for whatever reason. It just I was not aiming correctly. Cause yeah, that's the problem. There's like an again a two entryway point. So you got this long way this way, which really sucks. Ah. Uh. I don't know if there's a way for me to do that. I'll definitely have to use... Oh no, it is a $2 donation. I just felt weird saying it. I don't know. This is, I think, I feel like this, this is the first tip I got. I think it is. <laughs> but either way, people can see it. But I do like the little dog emoji thing <laughs> that I, I feel more concentrated on that <laughs> but, okay uh, so I feel like I definitely have to use I'm going to have to use stop worm Oops. oh this one sucks this is this one there's a like a two entry point thing actually wait I think I upgraded I have at least one praxis can I Decreases chance of detection. Okay. I don't know how much it's gonna help me now. And this is just one upgrade. Okay, so that just costs an upgrade point of one, which is actually great. Fortify. Okay, so these are all one points. 
And these are all one points as well. Okay. Yeah, I have one attempt left. Hmm. Trying to think. I mean, it's like I don't want to use all of my all of my stopworms and nukes. For this, but I do want to get it done at the same time. Okay. Thirty percent detection. Damn it. Ugh. There's no way for me to do this anymore. Because I have no more attempts. Doesn't mean I can't finish the mission? <laughs> oh, this really sucks. Yeah, and I don't think there's no way. That's a five rating. Poo. These people are just like wondering what's what's that person doing in the corner the entire time. What? There's supposed to be an item called Odd that lets you instant hack stuff. Weird. <laughs> it's like... They know it's mission... What? Come on. Denied. Oh, this is sucks because it's a two. I need to. Problem is, I would need to. I definitely need to buy stop nukes and stuff for this. I want to get this done. I want to complete this. But that is So the main main issue is one, it's like a how to best describe it, it's like a two entry way type of hack, so it can come at me from two different points. In addition to that, I have to go, I have to hit, I need to take over two points to the, I can't, to the nodes. Here, 
everything for good price. Do you even have it? No, he doesn't have it. So the word. Hmm. Thank you. Come again. I'm trying to think. Where did I see? Where did I see that you can buy the all the hack stuff? <sighs> Okay. This uh, this sucks, but I do have to. I'm gonna have to end it here. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! Oh no! Is there anything here? Oh hello! There's something to read. Dragon Heads: The Triad in the 21st Century: The Backstreet War. By far, the incident that left the biggest imprint on the Triads of the 2010s was the Mark Gore Lao Lao War of 2018, a conflict between established groups like the Wu Xing Wu, Sun Yi Yun, and 14K, and several smaller pretenders to the throne. To this day, details remain sketchy, but it appears that the untimely passing of the Mountain Master of the Four Dragons ignited a storm of accusations among many key triads. What began as dissent spilled into the streets as gangs engaged in violent conflict. The war escalated to such levels that military police were called in to curb the threat, and by the time the smoke cleared, a new hierarchy had ascended to take the place of the old. Led by newly empowered groups led like the Red Arrow Brotherhood, LMF, and Luminous Path. Okay. So. Oh, whoops. Keep doing that. Um, right now I'm trying to decide... I mean, one, I say it, but I don't even know how well I'm going to be able to do it. So, Agatha Knife is done. So, I'm thinking of streaming, at least try to stream on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so they will be shorter. Um, and again, if I'm going to be streaming on Sundays, just if, depending on how the heat's going to be, I'm going to try to to go early. So... Literally, I would say between 5 a.m. and 7 a.m. for me, postal, postal coast time, postal coast time, Pacific coast time. <laughs> oh boy. Um, yeah, I mean that would be the aim. Um, because yeah, the depend that really it just depends on the weather and stuff like that. But postal. Sorry, I'm still laughing at me saying postal coast. That's not what I meant to say. Um, so yeah, maybe Tuesday, Thursdays. But again, it, it's going to be harder for a lot of people just because it's going to be an evening for me, which majority majority of people are either three hours ahead or a lot more than that. So either way, I'm going to next time, next set, we're going, I'm going to buy a ton of nukes and... Stop worms just to complete that one mission there. They're, they cost like what, 50 something? So it shouldn't be too bad. Either way, thank you for liking if you like. Thank you for commenting if you commented. Thank you for subscribing if you subscribed. Thank you for favoriting if you favorited. Thank you for simply clicking on this video. Until next time, guys. See ya!